Hello everybody and welcome back to Autobox Plays, The Binding of Isaac Afterbirth. More challenge runs today! Woo! Don't we just love a good challenge run? And today we are gonna do it! The purist. Let's get started. Uh seed is T1 PB 1 E Q C. Yeah, you can hear Max in the background. He is just eating like crazy. As he's wont to do. He's eating his dinner, as he normally does. Um, just got done eating his food. He had some egg rolls today, it was pretty good. Oh, John. Okay, so let's see, what are the possible win conditions that we can use to win on a loss? No, what boss one? The purest. Mmm... Let's see. There are no item rooms, so we have to- we're banking on the fact that we can hopefully get some value out of like a deal with the devil, so getting some sort of like bomb, like not really bombs, but getting a early lead on probably some spirit hearts or tainted rocks or any sort of value we can get from this is something that we want to take into account. Um, we're going to mom's heart, so this could potentially be a rather hard challenge. Um, let's see. Hopefully we get some, like, a DPS upgrade from our boss fights. Let's see, items that I could possibly want. Mm, I would absolutely appreciate getting, like, a squeezy for the two spirit heart protection, and also getting a... maybe just, like, a damage upgrade, like a speed, like, growth hormones or something like that, just because it would allow us to get away from enemies faster and just having more damage, more damage to kill them, and also... Just moving faster out of their way, or something? Just dodge, having that split, uh, extra speed might give us the ability to dodge SOMETHING faster! Almost walked into Lust. Okay, let's see what we got. Balls of Steel, no. I want to assume it's here. I really want to think it's here. It's not there. Shit. Here? Okay. Ooh, baby, the the quarter. So that actually means we can go back and play that judgment. And you know, what? I'm feeling lucky. Let's go back and play. Hopefully, we get something out of it. Alrighty, judgment. Don't be a a turd. Bum friend, I fucking hate you. All right, we'll pick up bum friend, and let's just do it to it. Actually, you can go ahead and pick up this penny. Because I can't really do anything else with it. There you go. Hopefully, we have a good amount of money. Hopefully, Bumpen doesn't end up screwing us up, screwing us over. Larry Junior. Oh, excuse the burp. That was a little. I don't know. It's like it's it's. I know. Okay. How do I want to put this? So ever since I was younger, this sounds kind of dumb saying it out loud, but. My parents never really taught me how to eat, or like the idea of like slowing down. So I've always been like a fast eater, and like because of that, I like I usually get like kind of burpy whenever I eat. Ah, jeez, don't come on! Almost done. Thank you. So you gave us extra HP. It's really important for us to dodge on the next floor, and considering how we've been playing, that may or may not be a possibility. So we're not going to go to the curse room, because there's nothing to gain from there. Um, I'd really appreciate having a bomb. A tinted rug would be absolutely fantastic. Red heart is nice, but not necessary right now. Hmm. Alright, dodge around, go up. And you can make it through here. And there we go. More red hearts? Not what we're looking for. I felt like that was kind of close. Like I almost walked into him. Let's go to the shop. And yes, thank you, thank you, thank you. We get a spirit heart. That's fantastic. And we'll pick up a key. Just for the extra security. Um, I think it's in our best interest to actually play this. And hopefully get something... You will get the pennies. Give me something. It gave me a bomb. 
And we'll play you. We'll go down to like 15 cents. Half red heart. Okay. And we'll play you. Okay. I'm gonna go back for that extra HP that we picked up. I may or may not continue playing the Blood Bank. It would be nice if we actually get a payout. But I ain't holding too much hope if for that actually happening. Hmm, if I were a secret room, where would I possibly be? I would guess here. Fuck. Alright. Well, it's not there. Means That means we can't get into our curse room if we wanted to. So we're gonna be aggressive, at least when we get into this room. Killing these enemies before they get too close. Kind of scary. Okay. That was bad dodging on my part. And... I really, really want a Tinted Rock on this run. You know what? Pinky Eye is pretty good. I like it. Mm, I think it's in our best interest to actually just go ahead and fight the boss. Even though it's in a tiny room. Oh, fuck. We shouldn't... We shouldn't get hit by Monster, but we, ended up, we did. Which kind of sucks. Okay. Ah, uh, Tiny Room Monstro, fuck you. Oh, goodness. Oh, okay, cool. Yay, we gotta deal with the devil, even though I don't think we should. Mm, both of those suck. Both of those really suck. Um, I'll take the Razor Blade, I guess. And I'll pick this up, but that's really shitty. That's so bad. You're not getting any of the big money. Pick that up. Thank you. Ah, oh, that's really, really bad. I came to this room hoping that there would actually be a spirit heart, but that's not the case. Hmm. I don't know. We'll just go to the next floor. Hopefully, get something from a deal with the devil on there. The world. I will save the world for the next floor. And you know what? If we are, we have money to buy another near their heart. So, I think it's... I think we can actually go to the curse room. We already got our deal with the devil, so that doesn't bother us too badly. Okay. Thank you. And, of course, it's nothing good. Hmm. This is kind of shitty. Kind of shitty. Cheat this out. And a penny. You can have that. Alrighty, going down to the next floor, and this is not looking so good. Not looking good at all. Okay, so let us play the world. We know where our shop and our secret room is. Let's take a quick peek in here, see what we got going on. Just two stone chests. Potential is there. We could get like a Steven or something of the sort. But... Ah, uh, it's... I don't know if it's necessarily worth it just because of the fact that we may get hit in there. I mean, grant, granted, our deal with the double chance isn't, isn't too spectacular right now. But, you know what? I think it's something that we have to bank on. Because we need every advantage we can get. Come on. Thank you. Alright. So I'll take a look in the secret room. Hopefully something good in there. Just two keys. Meh. At least the rooms are relatively easy. We're not gonna get... We shouldn't get damaged by these guys. I'd be surprised if we did. Uh... Come on. Thank you. What we got going on in here? Blank card. You know what? I'll stay with blank card over the other one. Uh, Razor Blade, just because we can get more advantage out of it. I well, more like more than likely. Kill this guy. Oh, baby, a spirit heart. I think it's in our best interest to go grab it really quickly. And I'm surprised that I actually killed them. 
That's why you shoot the poop all the time. A spirit heart is a very rare drop. So happy as hell to have that actually happen. And I'm hoping we get like a tarot card. Because Link Card Sun, classic combo. Mmm, what else? Do strength card? So maybe we can sneak an extra deal with the devil or something like that. Holy hell, we got another one there taking damage. <laughs> Woo, what a wild ride. But speaking of a wild ride, uh, this isn't the best segue, but I'll use it anyway. I just actually recently, recently, the other day, I started watching JoJo, JoJo's Bizarre Adventures. Ooh, blank card hangman, blank card two of diamonds. Pretty good, pretty good. Um, I'll stay with two of diamonds for now. But we basically have infinite money if we wanted it. Alright, let's go and see what we got going on. We're going to, going against Chad. Hangman wouldn't have been a, a worse, a, like, a terrible card to get against him, just because it would allow us the ability to fly. And flying makes it so that we can actually just hide over the rocks. But, you know, Chad isn't too hard of a boss, so we should be fine. As long as you can get some dank poison shots on him. Then he should die relatively quickly, even though our damage is pretty trash. Gotta be careful of that. He gets faster and faster every time we hit, he takes damage. Come on. Oh, goodness. Almost done. I, I sincerely think he should actually kill his spawns, just because uh, Chubb does that. But, I don't know, that's just me being nitpicky. Fuck. And he does a full heart of damage, which is really disappointing. Thank you. And we gotta deal with the devil. Okay, please be good, please be good. Yes! Yes, very good. <laughs> as long as we don't take a full heart of damage, we should be fine. Um, so I'm actually gonna pop this. Let's go back to this. Go back here, and we'll actually buy this. It's a luck upgrade. Fantastic. And buy that. Pop it again. Okay. I mean, this is very good. Although, I'm really, really scared because we could easily die. And there's no real point in holding on to this anymore, so let's just hold on to Hangman. Because it's a more immediately useful card. Alrighty. So, Brimstone is a f amazing item. I can't really say anything else besides that. It's just... Infamy is helpful. Is very, very helpful. Um... Yeah, not worth it. Okay, let's just not get insta -gibbed. No, 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 no! Okay, we're good. Thank you. I was legitimately scared. So we should probably bomb the nickel guys. You can have that. And you can have that as well. Give me something good. Just a bunch of keys. That's fine. Yeah, Brimstone basically saved this run. Not that it needed any particular saving, it's just... Uh... It helps, that's for sure. Alright, so hopefully we don't find an asshole in the shop. Of course we find an asshole in the shop. Thank you, and you can have all that. I can see forever. I can see forever. Alrighty. Give me some spirit hearts, give me something. Stars? 
Empress. You know what? We'll take Empress. Infested. I'm hoping that we get like an HP upgrade. That's why I'm taking the pills. Just because we're on we're rocking the one heart container. Hmm. No tinted rocks. Great. Oh hell yeah. Uh blow this up because it's just good value. Anyway, yeah, back on the JoJo's Bizarre Adventure. It is pretty good. Um, I'm only I'm starting from the beginning, even though Arcada mentioned that you don't really need to watch the first nine episodes. But you know, I feel like if I'm gonna start watching a show, I might as well start from the beginning, even if it's not the best arc. Okay. Eek! Great. And we did get a deal with the devil. It's a little surprising, but alright. Something good. If you give me spirit hearts, I would be very, very happy. You know what? That's fine. That's probably the most objectively good uh, s devil deal we can get. Anyway, I'm gonna take a sip of water. And I think by the time this video is up, it should be post-Christmas, actually. The last episode was Christmas on Christmas Day. Anyway, um, hope you guys had a very happy Christmas. Very Merry Christmas. Um, Harry and Harry Potter. Uh, they actually say ha Happy Christmas, which is weird. And uh, it's, it's, a, it's a cultural thing. Emperor. Hmm. Nah. We're good. Oh yeah, and speaking of which, I am about 284 pages right now through the Deathly Hollows. This one, uh, Ron? Like, they're, they're still having, they're getting pissed at each other because they don't know where the, know where the Horcruxes are. Dude, these things are tanky. Like, legitimately tanky. Alrighty. You can have those? It's a pretty shitty trinket, gotta say. You can have all that too. I am gonna go back for the shop. Hopefully it is just this way. And I know we left Pinky Eye back. We'll get it on the way to the boss room. I'm not gonna rock Isaac's heart Isaac's head forever. Pick this up. I'm not even gonna pick up the money. It's just not worth it. Because we already have infinite money. We have 99 cents, which is basically infinite infinite money. Because it's highly unlikely that I'll actually end up spending all of it. You know what? That's probably the best, like the only good pickup you've actually ever given us. You can have that. Yeah, actually, you should have taken it, but whatever. All right, we're gonna go back and let's fight the boss. We are in Dank Depths One, so we got a little bit of ways to go, but we should be completely fine. Thank you. Let's charge it up. Dodge around. Good, we got his bomb buddy. Let's pick it up, might as well. Lowered our damage, increased our luck, and increased our fire rate. So you know what, this is fine. We have brimstone, so our brimstone laser should just be like super, super good. Okay. Didn't really, didn't even affect our speed. Holy shit, our brimstone laser is so shitty now. It's like firing soy milk, like, like 
It's close to having soy milk levels of brimstone laserness. Give me small rock. Yes, we won. We won. Thank you. Yep, we totally won. Yep, completely a thousand percent won the game. <laughs> and yes, we will pick this up because it just absolutely benefits us. And do we want to fight? Is there anything worth? No, nothing at all. All right, we're going to go down to the next floor. And this should be a fan-freaking-tastic run now. If only we actually had, like, Spoonbender. That'd be freaking hilarious. Uh, blow this up. Thank you for the tinted... For the spirit hearts. And thank you for the extra spirit hearts. We'll just do this. We'll just wedge ourselves in. Hopefully get some, like... Alright, goodbye. A key... Eh, I don't really feel like looking around. Oh, hey, that was pretty sweet. Thank you. Uh, there's intended rock raids up here, so let's blow this up. Almost got hit by the red poop. That was almost dumb of me. More keys. Thank you. You can have all this. I've never seen- well, the only good payout that I've gotten from Bonfen was just literally a spirit heart. That's it. Everything else he's giving us isn't too amazing, in all honesty. Scrum friend, you're you're trying to help, but your help isn't completely necessary. Or it's not like super super useful. And I'm sorry if that makes me a shitty person for saying that, but I'm just gonna be gonna be truthful with you, man. Your 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 contribution isn't cutting it. Um. No, nah, we're not gonna pick that up. Even it's just gonna it's gonna take us out of the horror Babylon state, so not worth it. Are you missing somebody? Okay, just keep going this way. What do you got here? The Joker. Pop it now. Now, nah, we're gonna pick it up. Not worth our time. There you go. Yeah, this run is just completely over. <laughs> There's. I'm not even gonna go back for these bombs. Let's go down to the next floor. And this will be the last one. Yeah, we're just gonna run through these rooms. Ah. Okay, cool. We're good. Let's see, where could you possibly be? Come on. Drop down. Thank you. Alright. Where the hell is the boss room? I would assume going back up here. So let's just keep going up. No? Hmm, then to the left. Not even here. Alright, there's only one way to go, so let's go this way. Yeah, I don't even care. 
dodge around. And with this, it's over. We did it. We beat the purist. So we got going on in here. <laughs> if we were keep, if we're still playing this run, then that would be fantastic. Anyway, we unlocked Bracano. Sweet. Anyway, that's the run. If you liked the video, please hit the like button, it helps out a great deal, and of course subscribe if you want to see more in the future for now. Thanks for watching, and I will see you guys next time.